Hi, I'm David Byrne. Welcome to my master class. No, David, that's not what we're doing. Really? This is the RISD commencement, remember? My class is called How to Dress Like an Artist. This is the commencement? Wow, okay then. All right, here we go. Welcome to 2021 commencement. I would have loved to have been there with all of you in person today, but well, I can't. But we have some incredible speakers lined up to share their encouragement, their experiences, and well wishes. But this isn't about a bunch of talking heads. This is about you, the RISD graduating class of 2021. Congratulations on this achievement. And thank you all for doing this, for being this, for <laughs> going to school and actually finishing, and best of luck. <laughs> I'll be back in a little bit, but for now, I'd like to introduce President Summerson to officially kick off the ceremony. Welcome families, friends, faculty, honorees, staff and trustees, and most importantly, welcome members of the class of 2021 to Rhode Island School of Design's 137th commencement. What a year you have navigated to get here. The path to today was many years in the making, even generations in the making but I'll bet you never imagined your final RISD year concluding with all the challenges and upsets of this past one, which makes me wish even more that we were all together to honor your achievements and share in your joy. In spite of all this tumult, you have triumphed and we have all learned to look deep in ourselves and to carry forward what really matters. And today, all of you are what really matters. Today, you will receive encouragement and prudent advice from an amazing group of honorary degree recipients. Each honoree has demonstrated what talent, a developed personal perspective, and perseverance can achieve. Your RISD education has endowed you with all those traits. So listen carefully to the generous wisdom you will hear. I wanna add a few bits of advice as well, and like all advice, take whatever resonates with you. First and foremost, apply the same rigor, the same care and dedication that you have honed in your work and studies here at RISD and utilize it in the creation of your life itself. Think about your future as a part of your creative practice, which will become almost like a personal relationship, perhaps the deepest you will know. But also, put the same care and creativity into your other relationships, your friendships, and the very construct of your life and goals. If you can do that, even with the inevitable ups and downs, you will have a fulfilling life. And please remember to listen and have compassion for others these qualities have grown scarce of late. The world needs your optimism and wisdom to amplify them. One last offered lesson, one particularly important in our current cultural moment. Do not let anyone else's fears or weaknesses define you. Throughout your life, people will try to defeat you or define you differently than you know your truth to be. When this happens, look deeply at why. From personal experience, I can assure you that by doing so, you will uncover unexpected strength, reaffirm your own integrity and identity, and discover new doors opening to you. If you live your life, build your friendships, and make your work with honesty, sincerity, and humility, you will not be affected by other people's projections. Know your truth and live it. Do not let anyone else tell you who you are, what you represent, or how you should exist in this world. Make this pact with yourself that your graduation today is a promise to live your personal truth. Your degree is itself a huge accomplishment, but learning how to live your personal truth is the manifestation of an education. 
By refusing to be stymied by others' misjudgment, by circumstances, by people in power, or pandemics, you will discover who you really are. Those who surpass themselves at times of doubt or challenge or injustice stand a solid chance of making a difference in the world. You have within you a voice that is your own, a creative voice that you have developed here at RISD, and when you encounter a world that has never yet heard it, I guarantee you will be surprised by its transformative power. Through the years, you will also discover how powerful a tool your creative practice can be, however it evolves. At RISD, you learned all about the value of tools, physical, conceptual, and virtual. Today, in a sense, is my graduation too. My first graduation at RISD took place in the auditorium 46 years ago, which is just so hard to believe. But this year, I leave with you, celebrating my joyous 50-year relationship with this institution. I hope that your education will foster the tremendous launch of your capabilities, and that the friends and colleagues that you have made here will become part of a career as fulfilling as mine has been. For me, RISD became the internal compass that defined that truth of which I spoke. I believe it can help you to see what others cannot and to be unafraid to take on the biggest challenges. You are ready. Class of 2021, you have RISD deep inside of you to remind you who you have become. Listen, remember, ask the tough questions, never settle. I can assure you as a proud alum myself that your voice gets louder as you adapt it to new experiences, new opportunities, new challenges. Now, as graduates of RISD, you can choose what parts of your education you want to carry forward and those you want to shed, and so commence this new and most exciting part of your life. And as you blaze ahead, now as RISD alumni, Keep RISD in your orbit so that we may celebrate your successes with you. Congratulations, class of 2021.